The former senior Chinese politician Bo Xilai has told his corruption trial that he made mistakes that hurt the Communist Party but denied trying to cover up the murder of a British business associate by his wife. John Sudworth reports from the eastern city of Jinan. On day three of his trial, this once seemingly unstoppable politician came face to face with his nemesis, his former police chief and close friend Wang Li Jun, the most significant witness in this case so far. Bo Xilai was a charismatic politician in the very grey suited world of Chinese politics. Already among the country's 25 most powerful men, he was tipped for even higher things. But in February last year, it all came crashing down. These amateur photos show Chinese police cars surrounding a U.S. consulate building. Wang Lijun, Wang Lijun told the court that he'd fled to the Americans in fear of his life after he'd confronted Bo Xilai with an extraordinary allegation that Mr. Bo's wife, Gu Kai Lai, had murdered her British business partner, Neil Hayward, in a dispute over money. His death from poisoning in this Chinese hotel had so far been successfully passed off as a heart attack. In an attempt to keep the crime covered up, Wang Li Jun says he was removed from his post. Today, Mr. Bo made a confession. He'd made mistakes, he said, and let the Communist Party down. But on further elaboration, it turns out this is a confession of oversight, mismanagement, of not handling things better. He says he did not try to protect his wife because he did not believe she was guilty. Whatever his defence, though, his ambition had already earned him powerful political enemies and the actions of this man have surely finished him, as well as bringing some kind of justice for the murdered British victim at the heart of the scandal. John Sudworth, BBC News, Jinan.